McDonald's podcast where we McTell it how it is. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go around the McTable and introduce the McCast. First, we got the McCast member, Tony McBowers. Hey. We got James McDrake. Hey. We got Frank Martin- M- McMartinez. <laughs> and we got hey. Will McHolland. You, you, skip, right. you skip my hey. What, oh. You're unimportant. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Great energy, guys. Great, great energy. <laughs> We're eating McDonald's. There is no energy. No, so, no, no, we will have energy after this. So, uh, what's the point of this podcast? Uh, to make tell it how it is. Did you <laughs> hear the intro, or okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna talk about whatever. You guys want to hear the dumbest thing that was ever said to me? Yes. Okay. It came from Frank Martinez. What? What the fuck did I say? It was. Thing ever. I was wearing a suit one day, and he went, "You know, I've never thought about it, but will I have to ask?" And I go, "What?" And he went, "How do you pee in a suit?" <laughs> What Frank, you didn't know how to pee in a suit? <laughs> when did I say that? It was what? that shitty show in LA that, or next to Anaheim that we just ended up leaving early oh, from. Oh, Hacienda? Yeah, Hacienda. I was wearing the suit that day, and you, I was like, oh, I gotta go to the bathroom. And you said, huh. <laughs> I went, what? <laughs> and you were like, I've never thought about it, but I have to ask. How do you pee in a suit? <laughs> what? And, Frank, have you never worn a suit? I have, but what I'm saying is, you I haven't followed, worn a suit You followed it nice. up, you followed it, thank you, it is a nice suit. You followed it up with, Aren't you worried you're going to get pee on your dress shirt or something? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll move that out of the way. <laughs> I just no, really I'm, I'm, I agree with, I'm, not, I'm with you, Frank. Like, I'm really worried about getting pee on fucking my nice suit. Like, everything, like, I mean, you know, like... How do you pee? Like, laying on your back, like, all just shooting like, No, way, right? I just had bad... Bad. Pee experiences, pee, pee better. Pee. Yeah. That comes down to you. Like, just pee better. No, it's like if you got like a, like a hard stream and you're yeah, worried about backlash, you got to stand about. further back. You no. got to fair. fair. You know, I think I can get lazy. Yeah. I, I always pull one of these. That's why. I'm a hander. Oh, I'm a, I'm a well, hand. that's not because, that's not you're a, you're just fat and you're like leaning. That's so you just put your hand up uh, above the urinal. No, there is lean. guys like I you have I've been in the bathroom where I'm peeing and like I think I can pee right and. Then there's guys, I know I can pee. There's guys. Yeah. No, but I mean, what I'm saying is I can pee. Like, I can pee for like. Well. You, I don't know what it is about being guys, but like, if I don't pee for like 30 seconds, I feel like a bit like, oh, really? <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, that, <laughs> no, no, I'm with you. You yeah. took time out like, of your day for that? If I had yeah, to it's pee, like, oh, you couldn't hold that, yeah. huh, Nancy? Right? <laughs> If like, I haven't peed now like that you say that, yeah, set. me too. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? Remember it's like, like a pep talk with your and so girl, now, like, David. like yeah. every time I go into the bathroom, it's like it's a contest, and it's like, man, you run into those guys who are pissers, dude. <laughs> like, they are like hand on the wall, fucking. <laughs> I'm gonna need three points of contact. <laughs> They're, I'm about to unload. they're moaning. They're like, oh. Like they, uh. like they don't fill up their bladder. Like they've got it all the way up to their esophagus. They're just draining. Yeah. It was it's, either it was either cry piss or piss piss. Yeah, so exactly. they went. They went. That's yeah. why they're leaning because it, it hurts their face. They're just yeah. oh, in pain. Question, real quick about uh, answer real meters. fast. Yeah. Uh, when you when when you have to take a shit in public places, do you use the big stall? I don't. I don't. Yeah. Shit in public. Right? I don't shit okay. in public. I've never shot in public. Oh, really? Uh-huh. Never. Dude, shit in public's great. <laughs> <laughs> Go on. I want you to convince me to come to your side, because my yeah. side's pretty solid. Yeah, Guess like, what? You if don't I have, have to shit, to... I go home. It doesn't matter if I'm at, like, L.A., I'm like, oh, oh, shit, I have to shit. L.A.'s a bad place. I'm going home. To... They made See, a BuzzFeed you know, episode guys, about finding good bathrooms. LA's, LA's <laughs> just bad in general. You guys are missing yeah. out, man. You I'm just talking about, What's the best part about shitting in public? Shut up, James. What's the best part? The best part is the fact that it's like nobody knows who you are. So it's like it's Very a mystery. True. Very true. What you get to shoes? leave. You get to leave and like nobody in your household knows that you just left that in there. You like, can drop like the craziest deuce ever. Dude, and, and then you out. just walk out. And guess what? When there's guys in there, mm-hmm. you get afraid? No. That's the best part. You, <laughs> you try to scare them out. <laughs> yes, it's true. It's like, oh, like, oh yeah, this guy thinks he's going to piss uh, regularly. Not today. And then you drop a couple cans, you know. <laughs> No. Down into the you ever know those no, guys no. that are super confident in the, in the in their public piss game or public shit game? Like they go in there, they kick open the stall, go and then <laughs> come on, stop, <laughs> bitches! They think they're at the beach. They're like, no, I fucking grew up in Venice. Yeah. So in I Venice. do it. They go in there. And I didn't even see a bathroom stall till I was thirty. Like there's those guys that'll be wiping and then they're talking to you, in the, <laughs> like into your soul. Like, no, dude, don't touch your asshole and look at me. Oh! <laughs> I think. The, the uh, let me eat more of these fries now. Uh, you're not selling me on the. Right. No. <laughs> if anything, I'm further away. Yes. The, the key to public. I might just game never shit again. Just going never. in there and just cutting the first fart. 
You cut the first part. You you were the alpha dog oh, yeah, of the you're bat. The... <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. Just because we are in a McDonald's play place, Tony Bowers, will you go grab that Hello Kitty that is behind you on God the floor, please? Oh, man. What the... <laughs> this got really weird. I think the shit stuff was weirder than this. <laughs> will you shake that into the microphone, please? We just found a stray toy here at the McDonald's podcast. It is McLost. We will Mick return it to you as soon as you Mick find us. <laughs> It's a bobblehead of Hello, uh, Hello Kitty. So this is pink with a pink bow on its left ear. It's very cute. Do you think McDonald's toys have gone down? Oh quality? God, yeah. Yeah. Do you think like the 90s dude? Do you remember the like, trans? The do you remember the time they gave us those like Sonic just like the video, video games? games? Yeah, yeah, I have. And now we have bobbleheads. Get step your we fucking Mick game up, McDonald's. <laughs> we almost we always had bobbleheads. So I want my uh, Mick games. Do you remember the, the McDonald's Anyways. movies? Yeah. Yeah, like Grim Ass and the whole uh, McDonald's game? Oh, like oh no, no, I thought you meant like... Ones? I thought you meant the like the, the alien one they funded that was like an E.T. ripoff. Shut the... Oh, I, do, I remember... I don't remember watching it, but I remember... Uh, well, yeah, what was that called? Anyways. <laughs> Doesn't no, matter. I don't, McDonald's goes to right. space. At this, <laughs> part, at this part, you guys are probably wondering, what the fuck is this podcast? Here's what it is. Tony Bowers had what I consider to be the best joke of all time. <laughs> and he said... We should record a podcast at McDonald's. Naturally, Frank and I went, yeah. And then Tony, <laughs> Tony, Tony followed up with, we're going to eat our way through the entire menu alphabetically, starting with A, going to Z. Sure, the M section's going to be fucking impossible, but we'll power through. <laughs> so, that's what we're doing right now. The quality, quality moment. That is what we're doing right now. We're eating our way through the McDonald's menu right. while talking to shit. Should we name off what we're eating? Yeah, what are you yeah. eating? Oh, I'm, I'm eating, uh, I got two McDoubles and two McChickens and a large fry. Say that louder so everyone <laughs> yeah. on the internet knows oh, how fat you are. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't sound out of breath. <laughs> <laughs> and you definitely should We don't believe that you're eating. But I got uh, two McChicken, two McDoubles, and a large fry with a medium or, or orange high seed. That is a make a shit a lot of food. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. I am eating a single McDouble a large fry, and I have a large Dr. Pepper. I might, mid-podcast, go get an Oreo McFlurry. I'll keep you guys tuned. You get a McFlurry every time. Yeah, it's amazing. I'm it's, afraid it's the I'm right gonna, choice. I'm afraid I'm going to die at 30, Wait, but you, what, you what, get Mick over that. Was it, how many times did you come um, come to McDonald's when we ate here last time? Actually, it was the same day we came up with the podcast idea <laughs> that you... I came three made, days, you, or three okay. times that day, yeah. So... In the same day? <laughs> in the same hour. Oh, God. <laughs> and I am not ashamed to admit so, that. Oh, man. Well, we, we Anyways, Tony, what did you eat? Oh, yeah, fair. Oh, I already had finished it. What did you eat, I said? Where's the phrasing? Oh. What did you? Uh, I ate a uh, McDouble, uh, just like you, and a value fry. And a value fry. Value fry. A dollar fry. Tony Bauer recently lost a 110 child. 110 Oh, oh, oh. 110 pounds. And guess what? What? Put it back on. <laughs> podcast by podcast. Mick, yeah, you are. And Why I, are you winking and, and, and at the and microphone? No, shut up, because I'm going to explain it. I know you guys can't see me right now, but I'm totally finger gunsing the microphone. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. And James no, no isn't sound eating anything. Needed. I stole some of Frank's fries, actually. Oh. So. Uh, and now I'm going thief. to make a yeah. paper air, airplane out of my... Error plane. Error plane. Error, error, error. So, already off the list, we can cross out fries. Yep. You know what the best paper airplane and was? Mick Double. Did you guys ever have to do that in uh, in in high school? It was like make a plane that can yes. fly the furthest. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I did that in my uh, eighth grade. Uh, like I I was I was an asshole, <laughs> and so I decided that this was going to be my paper airplane, and I crumbled up a piece of paper into a tiny ball, and I threw it about as far as I could, and it got like a good <laughs> like forty feet. And that was the winner all the way up until the smart kids got They the allowed it? Yeah, they allowed it. It was it was a contest. Throw a folded piece of paper as far as you can. Did you fold it or crumple it? Yeah. I, I, I did what I did. There's no fucking difference. <laughs> there is folds in that thing. <laughs> you know, that's not wrong. There's it yeah. got to be at least a fold. A yeah. A single. No, I mean, when you opened it up, was it flat? Hell no. <laughs> So, yeah. I'm saying, I mean, fifth place, not bad for me. <laughs> no, 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 no. Fair enough. Yeah. You know what's weird? That's your smell, smell your burger. It smells nothing like meat or cheese or bread. I don't come to McDonald's and for real food. I come here for McDonald's food. Yeah. That's a good point. 
Me too. Like, I've never been, I want a five star hamburger. Let me go to McDonald's. Try the Angus meat. Yeah, oh God. Don't ever do that. I you know that they, they're, they're, they're missing a letter. It's, 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 it's anus. anus. It's anus, anus meat. meat. <laughs> The meat from inside. They put the a little cows. asterisk at the end of every yeah, one. Yeah, the, the G menu, is silent. Says, you guys silent don't even G. realize. We did they it. added a silent G, McDonald's, and we're on to you. We did it. <laughs> we did it. Umlaut it, but everybody yeah. knows yeah. this yeah. is yeah. anus meat, this right? This is silent G. This is anus meat for sure. What's your lettered word? I hate all the silent <laughs> letters. What's the point? Queef. I like. Well, what's, what's silent? Queef. Co- all There's those letters no- are there. Yeah, but yeah. please can be silent. So. Mine. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's Lloyd. Lloyd. L O Y O D. Lloyd. Yeah. That's double a, L. The double the silent L. L. Yeah. yeah. That's a queer. <laughs> that's, yeah. I mean, I don't, I mean, Shots I fired every Lloyd. <laughs> no, right into the bad. McDonald's podcast. That's just dumb. Why would you do that? Why would you do that to your kid? Make, he's got to waste every single time he writes his name on a piece of paper. He's got to do an extra little yeah. thing. You know what I'm well, saying? What would you name your about, first kid? Oh, like Bartholomew or something? Oh, what a fucking... <laughs> well, if they Why would like, you do that to that kid? I wouldn't. I wouldn't name my kid. Uh, that wouldn't be my responsibility. The the woman always names the kid. You just get sure. to say yes or no or maybe or Ready? like he's definitely not being Peter. <laughs> I'm, I'm fighting for Ignacio so hard. Like Ignacio all the way. Because okay. of Nacho Libre? No. Cause, well, not because of Nacho Libre because I want my kid to be not called Nacho but not because of the movie. Then You what? guys want to hear the most? Just because it's a cool name? Yeah. Yeah. No, I mean, Nacho, yeah, imagine yeah. being, no, yeah, because I can, I can imagine growing up with a kid named Nacho, and that guy was always cool. Yeah, yeah right, Nacho. Like, cool. You never yeah. meet an asshole Nacho. No, that's, Unless, yeah. Mainly because I don't know a Nacho. Is this going to be a good party? Nacho's coming. <laughs> it's going to be a great party. Oh, yeah, Nacho's Nobody's ever like, is this going to be a good party? Nacho's coming. Dad, dude, we're going to fucking booze, hate like, this. <laughs> yeah. <We're> gonna... <laughs> oh, his dad Frank? Yeah. 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 Oh, his dad Frank's here. His, dad's he, his dad party's way harder than Nacho. <laughs> you guys want to hear the, this is what I'm going to name my kids. Are you guys ready? So the first one is going to no, be... No, I'm not ready. I have to change your mind. Well, James, shut up. <laughs> if James didn't own a microphone, guess who wouldn't be in the podcast? My first one... <laughs> so that's weird. Uh, it's not recording. Yet. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, continue. My first, my first kid is going to be... <laughs> a good idea, Indy. <laughs> Indy. Indy. Like Indiana Jones, Indy. Oh, no one's going to get that reference. This, yes, they will. It's it's Indy 500. The Indy. second one is going to be Sandstorm is not from... The song. Oh no, he wants his middle his kid's middle name to be is not from. Yeah. Uh, but her first name will be Sandstorm. Why? It will be Sandstorm Holland, but the full name will be Sandstorm is not from Holland. Why a sandstorm? Yeah, it's, yeah. Like it's, so, it it's, yeah. it's such a pretty name. Sandstorm is a pretty name? That's yeah. the name of a techno song that was really popular in the 90s, Will. San- oh, Darude Sandstorm? Yes. Sandstorm is a... <laughs> Sandstorm is a real problem in the Middle East. <laughs> yeah. Like, sandstorms kill millions a day. <laughs> I don't know some, daily. I don't know. Arab These are made-up facts, but I'm Arab. telling you, if I say it aggressively enough and in this tone, I'm believable. I wasn't going to call you on it until you said it was a made-up fact. <laughs> now I'm going to argue it. Millions a day, Tony? Yeah, see? Like Stick I to your guns. You. I had you. I feel like an Arab would come up and just kill her. He's like, you killed my family. What's a good name for a daughter, then? Uh, I'm not Ashley. I've never met uh, an Ashley that isn't a raging slut. Have you guys? Yeah. Uh, you have? Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I can't say I haven't. I never really understood the whole name but, thing. But, okay, picture like, this. Can't no. name her this because this is going to be a bitch. Like. Yeah, no, picture this. Well, like, somebody's like, oh, I just fucked a girl. Nine out of ten times that girl's name is Ashley. I just had a one-night stand mm-hmm. with who? Ashley. Always. Typically. You never hear, I just had a one-night stand with who? Teresa. Jessica. That's, well, because that means Jessica Teresa too. is, uh, uh, I don't know what kind of name that is. See, Teresa. No, I wonder if you name your daughter Mother like an ugly ass name and she's still like a good looking person. No, I read like this no on the Somebody was, uh, it was a funny thing I read on the internet. On, and I don't know who said it, but it was, uh, man, if I have a, ever have a daughter, I'm going to give that fool up. I'm going to give her a boy's name because nobody ever going to want to fuck a motherfucker named Paul. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you went black. Uh, yeah. I, I know it was a black guy who said it, for sure. <laughs> who, who'd you have sex with last name? Paul. <laughs> Paul, yeah. Oh, man, Paul gives It depends on how hot Paul is. If Paul's pretty hot, I have to find him. <laughs> I swear to God, Paul, uh, yeah. he this shit. <laughs> no, I know. Uh, so what, uh, what uh, McDonald's are we at this week? What is this location? 
Uh, Mar- Marietta. Ooh, Winchester. Marietta. The Marietta McDonald's next We're going to go every Tuesday. We're going to go record a different Mick location. That's a lot of work, bro. That's yeah. A, I mean, we could Isn't it Mick You know what? If we, if we get sponsored. <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> yeah. If we get Mick sponsored. By some of those big Mick bucks. Mm. McDollars. We can get. We can get this. We can get our whole meals for. We can get. A, we can get a McRollin. We get a. We get a free item for. McRoll you know what? Everything we use. We should ask them for the for the for the footage because they do have cameras in there. They do. <laughs> Just you, you know it's pointed point. right at us, yes. going, "What the fuck are these Speaking guys of doing?" Footage, so footage. So this. Remember when we first came in here and there was that dude that was gaming hard in the corner? So <laughs> yeah. There was this guy who had a full gaming setup just going hard. At on least a $2,400 PC setup. Yeah. Going it was, hard. He, was, he knew what he was. He's been around the block a few times. <laughs> what we're, yeah. He didn't wake up like, I guess I should yeah, get a PC. He was a level 70 yeah. uh, something or other. Or get laid. So oh, wow. he's getting down here at McDonald's when we walk in. And I thought it was fucking hilarious. Will was thought like, that shit was dope. Well, they let him do here, that here at McDonald's. We were setting this up, this old podcast setup, and the lady that was cooking our food kept like looking over at Tony, like, "What the fuck's he gonna do?" Like, they would let that guy game hardcore, and he was okay. like, 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 he was like, he, might, was, yeah. he was shaking the table, <laughs> he wasn't at it. Yeah, he was like, <laughs> "Shit!" <laughs> and everyone would look at him, and he's like, "Sorry, I died. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, uh, shit, <laughs> I died again. <laughs> sorry, what's spawn the, killing. God, what's the most fucked up shit you do when you die on a video game?" Like the that. most like, fucked up Or like shit just I something do. you say or like. Dude, I've broken um, controllers. I once said I something that I regret. Broken. I was like, I hope you fucking die in a car fire. And then, like, <laughs> I left, you know? And then I was like, damn, I just put that on somebody. You know? <laughs> like, they're thinking about you it. You put that bird on them and they're like, ah, oh, fuck, now don't I gotta do that, it. Don't you put that bird on me, Tony Bowers. And they're probably sitting on their end. Like, well, I'm they don't say gonna... Tony Bowers. They say, you don't put that burden on me. Beat my meat 23. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's no 23. It's actually just beat my meat. You can follow me on Xbox. <laughs> Adam is a friend. Beat my meat spelled uh, B- E-E-T. Uh, yeah, B-E-T. B-E-E-T. Three E's? Uh, three T's or something like enough T's. <laughs> you're going to look at it and go, is that too many T's? And, and you'll be like, you know <laughs> what? And then all of a sudden I pop up, there I am, beating my meat. <laughs> <laughs> no, no I-N-G. It was not Panta. I do it right now as I play. So beat really, really all you have to do is type in B and it will just naturally assume you want to follow Tony. <laughs> yeah. It'll auto-correct it to beat my yeah. meat. And then no. you just click yes. I think I'm going to change that to all my handles now, though. And like, beat my meat. Beat my meat. That's what? actually my PS3 handle. That's what I 100% beat my meat with I enough T's. You know what's funny about beat my meat is that everybody, like, no matter what, like, whoever, like, whatever game I'm playing, it could be Madden to whatever. As soon as I get on there, they go, beat my meat. Oh, man, that's funny. <laughs> I love it. And I don't have a mic, so I just sit there and go, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> yes, they love me. <laughs> no, I kill you. My, my gamer tag is at least six people. Because I'm clever, so when I kill somebody, it will say you were killed by at, at least, least six, six people. people. Yeah. Or at least six people killed you, or you killed it. Because I'm clever. Tony's funny, I'm clever. <laughs> No, mine's not clever at all. It's just the Drake 0404. Yeah, yeah see, really you, real know, lame. you know what that classifies you as? Yeah, Dang. basic. No, basic, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, like, basic. what you add numbers, what, what are the numbers significant to? It's it my birthday. Oh, oh, see, super basic. Super sick, yeah. super basic. You know why? Is that also your pin code? It's no. like, I hate James Drake's <laughs> pin code is 0404. <laughs> no, it's not. It's 27 to. It's 0401. <laughs> <laughs> All right. He's got we're going to wrap this up soon, so we're going we're gonna to try a trick. I'm going to toss a fry well, in the we'll air. We've 18 minutes. We can keep going. Nobody wants to listen to a 20-minute Mick podcast. Get All the right. fuck out of here. Are you People kidding me? People listen to, like, two-hour-long yeah. podcasts. That yeah, but they're before. not in McDonald's. <laughs> Fair, I don't want to be in this McDonald's. Long, so. <laughs> yeah. Fair it's enough. more for our sake. Like, All right. Sanity. I got you. I'm going to toss a fry in the air. And then I'm going to rapid fire another one, and then another one. First, I'm going to go Tony, then Frank, then James. And the second all of them catch a fry without dropping <laughs> is when the Mick podcast is Mick over. Are you ready? First, fuck? I'm going to toss you the fry catch in the air, catch it in your mouth, and it has to go Tony, Frank, you. Nobody can drop. You all have to three catch on the exact same round, and if you don't, it, can, it continues. This is terrible. Ready? Three fries is ready? what I think. Tony first. I'll try at least one or ready? two rounds. Ready? <laughs> ready? Or I'll go you're, two you're rounds. Next. Hey, two round max, and then it's like I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> you're not throwing any more fries in your face. We're just Ready? making a mess. Like I'm like a person. One, two, ah! No. Well, we continue for another Mick five minutes. <laughs>
Five McMinutes. That's the rule. Five McMinutes. Okay, so I think my... we all need a refill. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. uh, we're going to take a quick pause so while I we guess. refill. Oh, you're going to listen to only James by himself sing what we believe to be Darude Sandstorm. Go ahead, James. Give him some entertainment. I don't know. I could just pause it. I mean, that could work. I don't know the Darude thing. Uh, I'm just going to sit here awkwardly and talk to nothing. Hey, guys. Um, they left to go get refills, so now it's just me in a playroom. Um, so, yeah. Uh, surprisingly, we haven't got stopped yet. No one's even come in to question it. Like, we got the mic set up and everything, and no one's paying any attention to us. With the, it's, it's about 11 o'clock at night, and we're just... In the playroom. Are you still talking? Yeah, I'm just talking about. Monologue? Yeah, just a monologue. Monologuing? Are you oh. making monologuing? Yeah. I'm just describing the room. Been here for three days. Just explaining that we're here at 11 o'clock at night in a playroom in a McDonald's. Three hours. And that no one later. stopped us yet, and I'm just surprised. So maybe you guys can help me with this. This is you a problem. Think they'll uh, take my order from the door. Hey, I want <laughs> a, a, a pie. <laughs> First, why did it take you so long to say pie? Well, did you want I to say I, pie? Yeah, I wanted to say pie. <laughs> I really wanted to say pie, but that would have been... I don't think that's correct. And first of all, I think so, I might think it's something else. Maybe you guys can help me with this. This is a problem that's grown in my life. Ooh. Frank already knows. I've mentioned it, you guys. So I get called Ed Norton daily. <laughs> yeah. I get told I look like you Ed Norton. You know what's Norton. funny is I have a friend that looks way more like Ed Norton than you do. <laughs> Frank, will you like, bring him around? <laughs> I could, yeah. Like, I've been... Since I started working, if actually, I do, if he put on you guys, probably could be like halfway brothers. You guys should have like a Norton off. Since I uh, he wins. <laughs> <laughs> since I started working my new job, I have had like, and the only people that mention it to me are like thirty and over, cougars. and like yeah, cougars. I've had two cougars. One's given me her number, and one asked for my number today. So if I really wanted to just bang cougars, like I can bang the you kind of look like Ed, like Ed, you kind of look like Ed Norton pussy is my demographic. <laughs> <laughs> I can, you know I can get all of them. I have a theory about cougars is like they okay they're like they're average looking chicks who learned finally learned how to like be halfway decent looking and now they're like <laughs> I want to fuck every guy that kind of was mean to me in yeah. high school and you look like a guy who was kind of mean to yeah, every girl yeah. in high school. And so you're going to get, like, I'm getting that 30-year-old, because I'm like the guy that's like, oh, I should have fucked a really tall guy. Like, 30-year-old women, and, like, they're like, they're, they're like, their yeah, they're fuckings. like, they're like, man, I never fucked a tall guy. And it's yeah. like, oh, yeah, there, it's like, there's one. And then it's like, hey, goes of Christmas fucks. Yeah. <laughs> goes of Christmas. Yeah, they're just going yeah. through, like, a lit. So, I mean, uh, eventually, eventually they'll get to the short they'll get to the shorties. Guy. I think you that's, like, 39. So. Say, fatties are never oh, in. Fuck you. Well, no, for the gay guys. They yeah. are. are in, oh, dude. fat gay guys are. If you fat gay guys. No, gay. no. Dude, fat. How many girls? I'm sorry. There are girls who do like a little bit of the cushion. Yeah. Fact. Name name them and give us their social Every security. Girl. <laughs> Every girl I've ever slept with, they like they like the big news. No, yeah. All two girls in the all world, guys. Two. Fuck you. No, I, oh, I thought they, they I thought that. they make open yeah, the yeah, door yeah. on us. I was like, ah, oh, they found us out. Make but. open the door. And what the fuck are we hiding? Yes, we are. Yeah. We're gonna go so, anyways, <laughs> back on. <laughs> I'll just take the mic and I'll yeah. go. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no. If that's your demographic, I say explore. No, it. I don't. I don't. <laughs> I don't want to. Will doesn't want to. No. Oh, he's, then he's not down with the old pussy. I am not down with the old pussy. You have. I can't. It's wait. It's not to, even old pussy. You know what's funny is like not, you're gonna like you, you might look back on this yeah. podcast when you're like 40 and be like, I was an idiot. <laughs> Why am I 30 George old Bush? pussies, great pussy. <laughs> Why am I George Bush? I don't know. That's a, I mean, that's the character you develop through your comedy career. You just be like this guy who squints and just. Oh like, yeah, we should have mentioned that. We're all also stand-up comedians. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just me. <laughs> <laughs> that was a that was a low blow. I'm sorry, well, guys. That was a James Drake blow. <laughs> that's funny. I feel like we're gonna get a lot of these in the series. Uh, yeah, you shouldn't yeah. have started a podcast. Shouldn't have done it. Bad idea. <laughs> I'll just do it by myself from now. Why do you think they wrapped it in gumballs? Oh, the, uh, oh, yeah, so the, the bench? The, the bench around us the is counter, in, The uh, counter behind us is wrapped in gumball they, paper. Yeah. They wanted to know what it was like to be inside a rapist's house. Dude, <laughs> like a pedophile. <laughs> like I'm not going to lie, it makes me want gumballs. So if they're like working it up with a big gumball corporation, sold. Because I really want gumballs. It's either that or like a ball pit type thing. No, those are gumballs. Ball pits are uh, illegal. illegal. Yeah. Yeah. Illegal? Yeah. yeah. Kids die in them. Snakes. Snakes. 
Snakes yeah, will yeah, live in them. Pee, kids pee, pee in them. Poop pee? in them. And then snakes pee in them. Wow, kids are horrible. No, so but are mainly, snakes. mainly uh, the pee and the poop. Sometimes the poop. It wasn't the snakes. Sometimes. And then sometimes the snakes. Sometimes you get a ball to the face. Yeah, but I'm they tired of all these <laughs> goddamn snakes in this motherfucking <laughs> ball pit. <laughs> Yeah, uh, one, one of us had to do yeah, it. Yeah, I yeah. thought you were going to go, I'm tired of all these uh, yeah. goddamn balls in yeah. this goddamn yeah. ball pit. Yeah. Oh, I thought uh, that's where you were going with it. I'm tired of all these damn snakes <laughs> in this goddamn snake pit. <laughs> yeah, I would watch that who, movie. Who invented the pit of snakes? <laughs> snakes in a ball pit. And just Samuel L. Jackson I, I would, around the ball pit. I would watch any movie. <laughs> <laughs> I could watch that movie all day. And it's like, like he's just, and he's yelling at the snakes. Nobody's even yeah. there. God, what are you doing in the damn pit? I would watch any movie where Tony Bowers gets to impersonate Samuel L. Oh, that would be awesome. I'm tired of these goddamn snakes. Give us your best. What's your favorite line from any movie? Give it to us as you doing Samuel L. Jackson and goddamn snakes in this goddamn ball pit. Uh, I don't know. That's a lot. Of, let's see. I don't. But like, any line? Any line any from, line any, from movie. any movie. A famous but line. As as. As, uh, as that be like, character. be like, follow me if you want to live. Do the Terminator line, oh, but as no. Samuel L. Jackson in a ball pit yelling do, at snakes. You know, do the Forrest Gump box is like a uh, box is like a life of life chocolate. is like a box of chocolate, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you never know what you're gonna get, and then if you get something, it's a fucking snake. <laughs> More lines. Uh, we yeah, do. Whatever you want. What else? Uh, what else uh, uh, say you. hello to my little friend. Yeah, that's what I was Scarface. exactly where I was gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> what? You, oh, you staring at? But why don't you say hello to my little friend, bitch? It's a snake. <laughs> <laughs> His name's Chester. Say hello. <laughs> Dude, I know we're loud. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like oh, the notebook. There's a, there's a guy <laughs> totally staring at him. <laughs> He's and, on a tablet, so it doesn't matter. And on that note, that is the m- conclusion of the first ever McDonald's podcast where we McTell it how it is. Let's slip us out, Tony.